Good morning, family. Welcome back to my channel. It's Monday. It's an off day, so I'm just out here, man. Well, I'm not really out here. I'm at home in the garage. About to clean the car out. You know what I'm saying? Not my week's worth of uh, mess, but my day, day worth of mess and stuff in the car. But, you know. Man, I, I'm about to uh, probably head out to the uh, junkyard. Got to get some stuff. See if I can find a ram for this car, man. Because I'm... I'm tired of rolling on the stilly. If y'all seen my last video, and y'all know, not good. Not good. But anyway, man, catch me later. Yo! So, you know, first of all, representing my high school, <laughs> Inglewood, all day long, you know what I'm saying? But anyway, um, I'm headed out to, uh, the outlet polo style gotta get me some shirts man you know like just you know after a while uh, have, you know with my t-shirts you know i go through phases sometimes I, I like the form to fit small and then sometimes I, you know not small but you know fitting you know what i mean and then other times i like them to be big on me you know what i mean so Half the times I, you know, I can't find a happy medium with the stuff that I want to wear. So I'm gonna get some ideal sizes today on some on some t-shirts. You know what I mean? I ain't gonna go go crazy up there. I never do. You know, <laughs> you know, I ain't trying to impress nobody. But anyway, I catch y'all when I get there, man. Yo, I'm hitting. Those Australian mountains. At least I'm thinking that's Australia. Because th that's South Mountain right there. That's South Mountain. I know that's South Mountain. But South Mountain, what, once you start, you know, getting more towards like uh, uh, Levine, Phoenix, then, you know, you run into Australia, which looks like it's part of South Mountain in some parts. So I don't know if that's uh, Australia, but I think it is. Yeah, I'm out here, <laughs> man. I, I just got to the uh, to the outlet or whatever. So, man, it's time to go here and try to see what I can get. You know what I'm saying now, I love rocking low. You know what I'm saying, and it's not. I mean, it's a cool thing to it, but also to me, man, it's just quality. You know what I'm saying? But look, I don't be buying all that high expensive shit. So <laughs> I'm just a regular polo dude. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just gonna get some regular stuff today. We're gonna get some regular stuff. Grab some t-shirts and whatever. But let's see what we can get. Yo, what's good, fam? Yo, I just got up out of there. You know. I ain't want I ain't wanna film in there, you know, for you know, get any beef or whatever. You know, I remember I was in Chicago and I was in a Target and I was just so like, you know, I was just surprised or, or whatever with like how you can just walk through Target and then like look outside and then you know you got the buildings and stuff. I mean like I was just like, man, this is nice. And I was filming and they was like, you can't film in here. I was like, man, I'm filming myself walking through here. Like what's going on? But anyway, so, but anyway, uh, so I just picked up a couple of, uh, a couple of shirts like I, like I planned on and I got myself a wallet too. So, you know, got me a new little fancy wallet. <laughs> You know, because my old one, boy, is clapped. <laughs> my old one is clapped. You can't even see the damn. <laughs> like like Zosh would say, it's clapped. <laughs> oh, talk like that, though. But anyway, man, I got three shirts. I got so I can share that with y'all. I got a red shirt. I got a black shirt. And then... I got a red, white, and blue shirt. 
you know, so. Basic colors, you know what I'm saying? Just go with everything I wear every day, you know what I'm saying? Just so. That's my that's my trip to the store. I budgeted myself. I, I wanted to uh, only spend two hundred dollars at the most, you know. And I came to I don't know if y'all can see that one fifty one. Came to one fifty one today, so that's not bad, you know. And then of course I charged it. <laughs> I put it. I put it in. I put it in my budget to pay that off real quick. You know what I'm saying? It's just how it goes. You know, you go out here and work hard. You know, you can. I can't even say spurge because you you need clothes. And when I'm sitting in the car all day, man, I like to be comfortable. So, yo, what the deal, man? I'm out here, y'all. I'm at Zia Records. You know, my daughter she got me a, a gift card for Christmas. You know, so you know I'm gonna spend more than thirty dollars maybe, but. I'm out here, baby. You know what I'm saying? You know, just go ahead and get my my, my Christmas gift phone. See what I can get. I'm gonna holler at y'all though. I'm gonna see y'all in there, maybe. That was good, man. So, I done went through the whole soul section. I got the Point of Sisters live. And then, misplaced. This is hip hop. The Lions. <laughs> Shout out to, uh, you know, my co co host with the co co most, <laughs> King of Chill. <laughs> Shout out to him. So, yeah. Those are two records I see so far. You know, but man, this spot is it, it, pretty nice, man. Like, I don't know what's going on with my camera because it's super close right now, but yeah, this place is super nice, man. So, I'm gonna see what else I can get, you know. But I'm thinking this is gonna be a quick one because, you know, with me, like, I'm I like to buy uh old records, I don't like to buy new stuff, and a lot of the stuff is new, and then the old stuff they got them priced pretty aggressively nowadays. I remember like four, at least four years ago, man, I used to come up out here in these stores, man. Stuff that I got in my collection, <laughs> it's crazy. Yo, so man, I OD'd in the record store, man. You know, I really, really OD'd in the record store. Like, I got a bag full of tapes. <laughs> There's a bag full of tapes. Bought a couple of CDs. And then a few records, you know, I, you know, I have to represent my dogs. You know, these are my dogs right here, man, since day one, you know, <laughs> I just show y'all a couple of them, you know, and this one, I, I don't know. I've never heard of them before, but like just that cover, like what they have on everything. And then you know, Rush management, you know, so if Russell Simmons fucking with him and Daddy O, you know what I'm saying, all that, it's gotta be dope in some way. And then it's the whole record. So I got that. And then one more, one more for y'all. Okay, one more. I had to do it. You know, DJ, DJ, fresh, fresh, fresh. <laughs> Man, you know. But I think I'm starting up another YouTube channel. It's going to be a TYT PBC collections or recordings or something like something, something about like co collecting records and music and stuff. So, and I just put all that content on a different channel because, you know, with me doing Grubhub and my everyday vlog, I don't want to distract whatever subscribers I have, you know what I mean? With other stuff like records. <laughs> but anyway, man, I'm out of here. I'm on campus. I'm on campus. Yo, I'm at LP's. This is El Pisano's. You know, this is uh, where a lot of us like to go. Get that good Mexican food. You know what I'm saying? But I'll show y'all what I get. <laughs> It's lunchtime, baby. Yeah, baby. Yeah, baby. <laughs> I love coming to this place, man, because they give you a lot of food. 
You know what I'm saying? So you can pay like ten, eleven dollars for a burrito, but you ain't gonna eat it all, first of all. Well, I probably eat it all, but then also, I mean, you ain't gonna be hungry for a minute. So, what's that burrito? What's that burrito? It's a big old burrito, man. I, I, I love coming to this place. I think that's, I just said that but anyway, you know, so. I'm gonna get down on that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm Yo, what's good, fam? I finally made it to the yard, which was, I, was, which was what I had originally left the house for this morning. But, you know, you live and you learn. You know why? Because I knew I was coming to the yard and I forgot my tools at home. So I feel like a... <coughs> But the things I'm looking for, like, you don't really need tools too much for anyway. So, hopefully, you know, I find what I'm looking for. But then also, hopefully, uh, I don't need no tools. <laughs> man, I'm out here bad, though, man. I'm out here bad. I got all my Reeboxes, man. I ain't wore these things in, like, three years, man. But... I still don't want to mess them up, so I'm walking gingerly. <laughs> I'm walking gingerly through the through the yard. Just make sure I don't get too much mud on them and stuff. You know what I mean? Anything is cleanable unless it's suede. These got a little bit of suede on it, but you know the quality on the suede ain't even that good anyway. So it is what it is. I mean, but the leather on these ones is butter soft comfortable anyway yes i got the uh windshield wiper uh fluid thing that i needed mine broke it just kind of split along the thing so uh, along this bend right here it split where the hood closes so had to come to the yard and get another one hopefully this one holds up but if not i seen a couple of avengers over there where they got like the, this is plastic. Like, I mean, or like rubbery. These are like hard plastic. So that's why I broke. But anyway. Yo, what's up fam? Man, when I got home from, you know, doing my shopping and stuff, man, the damn uh, lock on our front door, that like screws came out and I'm trying to put it back together and stuff. And then, you know, screw is just not engaging. To come to find out that the screws really wasn't long enough in the first place. So I don't know how it held on for that long. It had to be like a couple years or something like that, a year or so. But I put, I went to the, uh, you know, I don't throw nothing away. So I went to the little box that I had the old one in and found some longer screws. So that worked out. So now get ready to, uh, put my stuff away that I bought today and uh rest a little bit and I might go out to the gym or something you know oh I gotta uh put the thing I got from the junkyard onto the uh, Dodge so that's what I'm about to do now I'm about to put the uh windshield wiper uh fluid holes on the Dodge I'm about to do that and then maybe just roll out to the gym I'm saying go get that hoop on you know how I mean you know how I mean <laughs> These bad, these bad dogs. <laughs> what you gonna do with that big old stick? What you gonna put it away? You, you act like your owners don't buy you no toys or nothing. <laughs> hey, queen. <laughs> Look at him with the stick. Like, yeah. Yeah, like he ain't got no toys or nothing. Well, he don't have any toys right now because they always tear him up fast. I love pooches. <laughs> Look at this dude. He is so goofy. The stick. What's up, little girl? Just chilling. He's gonna hurt somebody with that stick. And that somebody is gonna be me. I already know it. <laughs> Look this. Give me the stick. Give it here. Give it here. Give me the 
stick. Give me the stick, King. Give me the stick. Give it here. Give me the stick, King. <laughs> Yo. Man, I came all the way out here to the gym, man, to play ball. I went to the gym out by me. Nobody was there. And I couldn't even get no shots in because people were playing one-on-ones on both ends. It's crazy, man. But as you can see, it's popping up in here. It is going. So, I'm trying to play. Like his goings on, so get, get my game in. <laughs> so one win, one loss, won the first game by by hair. And then the second game, we just blew that one, man. We just blew that one. But I'm out here. I'm getting it in. That's better. That's as much as good. As, I mean. That's a good thing I could say. You know, at least I'm out here. At least I'm out here. What's good, family? I'm at home, as y'all can see. So, man, I just... I had a great time at the gym. I played one more game. We lost that one, too. <laughs> so, I'm about to uh, listen to some of this music that I bought today. You know? So, like, comment, subscribe. And I'm going to catch y'all on the next one.